What is going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Today, today's a special day because I'm wearing my stripy top that I always wear and we are reacting to treasure. Life could not be better. Life could not be better everyone. How are you all doing today? I hope you're doing incredible. I hope you have an amazing week so far. And we have today, Treasure I Love You and I want to thank you Treasure Makers for being the kindest. You're just so nice. Every group I've reacted to so far have been really kind to me. The Blinks, I love you. And the Treasure Makers, I love you, and the Army, they just, and twi what have TWICE fans called? Why don't I know that? I'm sorry, I'm gonna react to a beginner's guide to TWICE, don't you worry about it, but we have Treasure today. And I'm so excited, I watched the Unhelpful Guys thing, which was an hour long video, and you guys actually watched it. I did not expect people to watch it, but you did. I was like, no one's gonna watch this. But you did, and I was like, oh. They real ones, they are real ones, <laughs> I'm joking. Thank you so much for watching that though. That means a lot. I worked really hard on this. I'm really glad you liked it. So yeah, we have I Love You Today. How do I talk, how do I think this song is gonna feel? Gonna be, I think it's gonna be quite slow. Not slow, just quite chill. You know what I mean? Because I Love You sounds very sad. I was really wrong about that. Not sad, just chill. I think it's gonna be chill. Who bets I'm wrong? Who bets I'm wrong? I do. Who bets I'm wrong? Okay, let's get into this music video. I'm gonna have the captions on so I can see what I'm listening to, see the lyrics. Yeah, let's get into it. Okay, we're beginning with a visual of a pigeon. What does that mean? I'm joking. <laughs> okay. Give me visuals. I was wrong. I was so wrong. It's not slow. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. I've become addicted to your scent. Oof. Steamy. Steamy. <laughs> I really like this. It's for 50 seconds. No, I can't do this today. Sorry. Soz. No, if they're going to do a beat drop on me, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to leave. <laughs> I'm leaving this room. <laughs> oh, that scares me a little bit. I'm a little bit scared. What? I didn't expect that. They give, they, okay, I expect the typical beat drop, but they just add something spicy to it that just makes me act up, make me feel some type of way. That hit my ears, so I'm going back. This is kind of lyrics. The difference between this chorus. Thanks, guys. I'm a little bit scared. I was just about to say, oh, I hope there's some sort of rap in here. And they gave it to me. They gave it to me. Give me a okay. Choreograph a dance is what we say here. A dance. This is a dance, everybody. <laughs> this is how we dance. 
so I kind of, in, I, oh, look at that wave making a heart. So I kind of interpret this song like they just love someone so much they want to be with them. Like they, their scent, they can like, they just like can't get the scent off their mind and they just can't get whoever it is off their mind. Imagine Treasure writing a song about you. Are they gonna... Okay, this is called YG having a lot of money and being able to just splash it in the visuals. They have really splashed it in the visuals today. What? Yeah. They're so cool. You sneaky things. You sneaky things. You, YG have always got to put, YG are some sneaky people. They always manage to wallop their party sounding thing at the end. So you guys actually taught me that. So Blackpink always do it, especially in songs like Kill This Love and... Was it How You Like That? And they did it in Crazy Over You, didn't they? Yeah, so basically it's like, um, it's when they just like produce like a party sound at the end, like it's really upbeat with different lyrics that's different to the song and uses some sort of element from the chorus. And apparently YG or like managed to like always sneak it in somehow. And I've never noticed that with Blackpink's music, but you guys have told me now and I'm aware that's why they're being sneaky about this. I did not know. I didn't know. I, however, it is my favourite part of the song. I love when songs do this. My favourite song is actually... Oh. I know, okay. I, I Crazy Over You, when I first listened to it by Blackpink, I was like, hmm. I wish you could see in the video. And then I fell in love with it. I literally fell in love with it. And the party sounding ending is so cool. I just feel like that really help, helps tie the song together. You know? It's still going, it's still going. Oh, give me that. Who was that? Uh, 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 who was that? Who? Who? Who's that? What was that? Star on Disney. No, <laughs> don't give me no Disney Plus ad. Who was that? Notes. Let's take some notes. Who do we think that was? Okay, well, I've been blown away. So I'm just gonna lie on the floor for a bit. If you don't mind, just lie on the floor. Um, I don't think I can handle that. That was too good. I'm a little scared. Do they have, have they ever produced had a bad song? You know, some artists just have like a few bad songs, but that, that's what makes them an artist because they grow from that. It's a little bit scary how K-pop artists don't have any. They don't have any. So I'm a little bit scared, a little bit intimidated. Um, okay, the visuals were absolutely insane. They were on like beaches. It was very, a warm toned music video. We usually associate like warm tones with like love and passion and stuff like that. <laughs> so, sorry, I'm using my college talk. So. The inclusion of that, it was so nice. And like the beach, we usually like long night walks and like just the visuals were so bright and in your face and beautiful. Such beautiful colorization in the music video. I loved the colors um, of like the background drops and stuff like that. And the sets were insane. I loved the bit where they were all standing in the middle and there's water around. And there was a lot of a lot of use of water, such as the waves forming a heart. Oh, so good. And then the YG sneaking in that party ending. You know what, YG? You did that. Well done. You have formed a great group. Have they ever formed a bad group? I don't think they have. Formed Blackpink, legends. Treasure, legends. They have not managed to form anyone bad. Even though YG may have a little bit, maybe like a uh, to them because of some of the issues in the past with them. They do know how to form a group and they do know how to emulate talent. If you know what I mean. So that was absolutely sickening. I'm sickening. Everybody, okay. When, apparently they're releasing something on the 31st of March. How dare they? 
How dare they? This is rude. It's really rude of them to actually do that because I'm not ready. I'm not ready for them to... <laughs> nah, that's going to be on repeat. The party ending, the song itself was so... Well, I did lie in the beginning because I, I thought it was going to be sad. I don't know why I thought that. So, why would I think that? I swear one of you put it was really upbeat. You know, my mind, uh, no intelligent. Sometimes it's not intelligent. I just block things out. Uh, come on now. So I kind of interpret the song as just like, you have that lust and passion for someone. You have everything, like their scent. And like, they can't like be anything without them, you know? You understand what I mean? There's probably gonna be more of a meaning to that. I'm probably gonna be wrong. I'm sorry if I am. Explain in the comments what the song means. Because I'm probably going to be wrong, and you guys are going to be like, I thought you were so stupid. The song is not about that. It's about something deep and emotional. Because I always seem to get it wrong. Always. I've never got it right. So yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. That was amazing. I love them. Oh, I love them. I love them. I love them. I can't wait to continue on with their songs. I'm so glad I went into K-pop. I'm so glad Blackpink helped introduce me to the world of K-pop. <laughs> Chef's kiss. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'll see you all later. Make sure to subscribe if you would like to. My Instagram is it's Isaac James. My Twitter is Isaac Talks Music. Go check them out. And give me a follow if you would like to. You can subscribe if you would like to too, but you don't have to. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching this video. Bye.